Hello friends. Um today I'm going to make some kattu. Okay, first um in the previous video I told you that I was searching for paratha and I found it. So I am going to make a kattu with that paratha. Let's see how it goes. Okay. Um so I kept it frozen and now I let it to be uh you know unfroze a little bit and here is the inside okay it's very difficult to um get videos with the uh with a single hand and doing all the other things with your other hand so these are my spiders and my veggies and these are the only cut leaves that i left with okay i got um carrots some garlic ginger onions green chilies and and i got something else i don't remember i think i didn't film it anyways um let's go and make kattu okay um i let my um chicken to uh, soft a little bit and do it it's like torn okay this is me trying to cut vegetables oh my god it's so hard you know i have to get a uh, a vegetable cutter soon so i was thinking about ordering something from amazon i think this is it okay Okay um I think I am doing it pretty well I used to cook uh, when I was at home but um not much because mom my mom used to cook for me so I was like um eat whatever she make for me so yeah but now I have to cook for myself Okay, uh, now I'm cutting the green chilies and some onions. So actually, I have no idea how to make kattu because I have not made it before. But you know, um, everything has a first time, and this is also something like that. Um, let's see how it goes. Okay guys I cut all the veggies and I got carrot and chilies leeks onions garlic ginger and some bell pepper and this is my only curry leaves it's okay I'll ask my husband to bring some okay I got my chicken and my paratha so I marinated it with some spices yeah Okay um I put some pan and I on my stove and yeah At first I struggled a lot to find how to you know how to work with this Finally I found it so and I'm I'm like a pro now so here I'm adding some oil you know um for a chicken curry it's okay to add a bit of a bit more than you show I mean the oil this is some flower oil um so yeah let's see I'm not a good cook but you know but I'm acting like a good cook let's see <laughs> um actually um I am cooking in my shared kitchen I share my kitchen with uh, two of other fellows and they also nurses and 
today it's me alone so i have to clean everything up because you know i have to be responsible about what i do and every single time um i make sure to clean my kitchen and you know wash all the equipments that i used yeah that's how you should keep your kitchen especially when you are in a shared kitchen okay i'll show you the surrounding of my shared kitchen so here we have a sofa here and the view is so nice um, today it's not sunny but it's okay this is our kitchen top and we have blender we have microwave we have oven and yeah everything so this is my chicken is frying so I added uh, some water and some more spices so it smells so good luckily we have this otherwise we'll have to get in a lot of troubles with that fire alarm okay now I'll show you how to cook this okay this is the frozen paratas and you know it's covered with two uh, sheets like this and you'll have to do is just uh, keep a pan uh, to heat and just put it here and after like um, like 30 seconds it becomes so soft and crunchy so nice and and you have to do is just flip it up by whatever or however you do it and this is I just um, you know I don't know how to do it properly just burn a little bit anyway I'm doing great in the second and the third one so you see that is the middle of it is like puffing so that's good and in here you'll see my skills of flipping you know people have some hidden skills and this is me this is my skill okay I couldn't capture it properly okay I got um, three oh, no four paratas and I cut them into pieces and here I have all the ingredients needed for my kotu so yeah so now I keep another pan and added some oil of course sunflower oil and added my ginger and garlic it smells so good I'm a good cook just um actually I couldn't cook for my husband I think anyways I'll cook for you baby okay I have my curry here my pan here and my ingredients so now I added um, some you know carrots green chilies and this is some um, you know spring onions so it's not easy to do two works at once like uh, having your phone in with one hand and stir stirring the pan it's, it's hard it's hard definitely hard so I have to add the egg to the meat and I added some pinch of salt so now I'm stirring it properly okay so I'm getting better getting better day by day that's how people learn okay then um, so I stirred it so well um, also I added some uh, chili flakes my mom gave them to me and she gave me a bag full of spices so I'm using them okay now I'm adding some onions okay so then I'm adding my cut to pieces and some bell peppers and the other part of onions and yeah stir and stir stir so well okay it smells so good you know i'm so excited for kotu so i was like waiting so long to make this so i added some gravy from my chicken curry and i had some chicken pieces too 
Please look so good and smells so good just like that street got too but uh, I'm lacking their sound anyways I'll put a, a soundtrack of that okay now I'm done with my cut too so I've just stirred so well yeah I'm excited after so long I'm eating a cut too oh looks so good smells so good So this is the final outcome guys. I'm so happy finally I made it. Because I tried so hard to find Kutu. Anyways I found it and I made a chicken curry for that. Yeah, that's so good. Thank you for watching.